A new study raising concerns about COVID's ability to transform and potentially undermine vaccines through animal transmission. For the first time, there's evidence of rapid spread among wildlife. Morella Porter shows us the impact of the virus on deers and how it could affect us. It is spreading. Uh, somewhat quickly through the population. A new study out of Iowa reveals SARS-CoV-2, the virus which causes COVID-19, is spreading rapidly among America's most common white-tailed deer. Samples submitted to Penn State University showed of hundreds of deer tested, 80% came back positive for the virus. It is um, uh, conceivable that uh, this is not just happening in Iowa and, and perhaps happening in every part of the world where there are deer abundantly present. Experts say it's more concerning than it is surprising. Uh, and if we put that into perspective, uh, at the height of um, infection rate in people in Iowa, what was happening in deer is perhaps 50 to 100 times much higher than um, the infection rates in human beings. While it is not certain how the deer caught COVID, researchers at Penn State believe it was likely from humans. This pandemic uh, continues to surprise us uh, in ways that we, we, uh, we did not anticipate. Although there's been no evidence of deer to human transmission, the study says animal infection could create a reservoir, meaning the deer can infect other animals and possibly humans. Their concern is the emergence of new variants, which could make it challenging to bring the pandemic to an end. That will create um, the evolution of the virus, meaning the virus changing in ways that will be much more complex to, to not only track, but also to, uh, to manage in terms of um, uh, protecting human health. The Iowa Department of Natural Resources says this study should not stop hunters in the state, but they should wear gloves and a mask and wash hands and equipment. They should also cook game meat to appropriate temperatures. We want to remind hunters that to continue doing what you love and, and um, just remember to take these basic precautions when, um, when handling your harvest. In Cincinnati, Morella Porter, Local 12 News. Researchers say the best way to mitigate the virus among people and animals is for humans to get vaccinated. Interesting stuff.